Hey there guys, it's 3D Print Dude here. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to add a brim in the Bamboo Studio Slicer. I repeat, I'm gonna show you how to add a brim to your 3D print files to help adhesion. So step number one is to open the Bamboo Studio Slicer. Step number two is to import your file. We're gonna go with this tray on this build here. And what we wanna do here is we wanna make sure we have everything finished up, right? Chances are you're already at that step. Or maybe you're having problems with your 3D print sticking and you need to add a brim. So now that you're in the prepare tab, what we need to do is click on the preview tab and then let the Bamboo Studio slicer slice the file. Then after that, once it's done here, we need to go down to this middle section on these set of tabs where it says quality, strength, support, and others. Click on others, and this is where we can find the brim type right here. So if we go down to the third one here, it says brim type. Uh, if you're having adhesion problems, I suggest you use the outer brim only because it really kind of helps like with adhesion. So choose which brim you want right here. And then you can choose the brim width. I would go with, let's do 15 millimeters. Uh, I don't suggest doing that, but I'm going to do that just so you can see the brim here. So once you're done choosing the size here, by the way, it's pretty common to go with like five millimeters, just so you know. The next step is to go on up in the right hand corner and then click on slice plate again because it has to re-slice the entire file. I'm gonna move this here for a second here. And then as you can see here, it has made this brim around the 3D print file. And that's how to add a brim in Bamboo Studio Slicer. Hit me up in the comments if you have any other questions and please consider subscribing. I am a huge 3D print enthusiast.